You guys remember banqueting? Oh my god. There was this uncle, he put my hand, he was like, So are you staying now? Like, he just pulled my hand now. I think very weird lah, this si pepe. Oh. So I I needed money. I asked you, I said, hey bro, you got any job lobang? No? I expecting banquet lah. I got this fella, right, that wants you to beat him up for money. He's like, hey bro, I'm not bad lah. Like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, but like 300 bucks lah. And I was like, oh sh**. Is it a sexual thing? Yes. He wants yeah. to get beaten up and it's a common thing for him to get Great. beaten up to the point that he goes to the hospital. What? Welcome back to the Liquid Courage Show and uh, I forgot to say this in the past two episodes uh, but we are the only show filmed in an actual bar. Yeah, and today we are in none other than Al Capone. Woo! Woo! More specifically, uh, Katong, which is one of 14 outlets across mm. Singapore. Yeah, they're all over the place. And um, I know nobody likes Mondays. Like, who likes Mondays? You guys like I, Mondays? I, I like Mondays. You like Mondays? Well, I like if Mondays. you like Mondays and you want it to uh, elevate a bit, you want to enjoy a bit, you should come down to any one of the 14 outlets to enjoy Ooh. their Marble Monday promotions. Yeah, you know Ooh. what's available? Ask what me what's it? available, Nicolette. What's available? Well, what's available is a full tower, full tower of Heineken for only $29. Huh? You, yes. can get re you can get really, really Ooh. up uh, with $29 per tower and a pint of lovely, fresh Guinness. Oh my God, I love Guinness. You guys like Guinness, right? Guinness, solid Guinness for only six dollar and ninety cents. Yeah, it's quite cheap. Yeah, it's yeah, a really good deal. Cheap. Trust me, I'm not even I'm, I'm not even promoting it because uh, I have to. I genuinely love Al Capone's. I'm there. I wouldn't say which outlet, but I'm there a lot. I'm there a lot. And yeah, so join them for Marble Mondays. Uh, it's not Monday today. It's actually Sunday. Hey, which outlet? Uh, huh? Which outlet? What's that? Yeah, which outlet? Which outlet? Uh, I'm at. Uh, <laughs> Why not say? Because you know like any, anybody wants to no, meet you. No, because I really yeah. do not want to be disturbed. Yeah. You get to your drink. I really, yeah. I'm <laughs> all for that. You know what? I'll tell you what. If you see me at Al Capone's, right? Poke me uh, with your finger. Uh, finger, uh, uh, Unless you fi get consent for anything else. Oh yeah, my consent, you know, <laughs> after, I give you consent. You do after a few pints of 690 Guinness, you don't yep, know what. Yep. what, what Poke me and I'll buy you a Guinness. How about that? Anyone that comes up to me and say, Hey, I want a Guinness, I'll give you a Guinness. How about you that? You'll never see him at anymore. Yeah. Yeah, I had to say the, had to say the place, like, had, had to say the place. Yeah, uh, how are you guys doing, right? Like, I, I, okay, so right now, uh, not to repeat myself, but I, I lost my job. Yeah, I lost my job because- Are I you my, sad? I lost my job because I told my, my, my boss that I wanted to quit. So you sad or not? No, I've never been so happy, driven, and excited. Uh, liberated, yes, because I, it, there was nothing about that particular job that made me feel like, oh, Fuck this place lah, whatever. I don't like this person, I don't like the other person. <coughs> but it was more about it was more about just because I just felt like I was putting out fires for another person's forest. Oh. You know, I wanted I wanted to grow my own forest, you know, I wanted You're to doing grow my the own Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I personally manscape, but was that? What? You manscape? Yeah. Oh right. I just I just put uh 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 it's concealer. Oh <laughs> yeah. Yeah, concealer does the job. There's no difference, but it does make your cock smaller. Like it looks smaller. It's still the same size. It's still the same uh -huh, size. Because it conceals it. I see. Cock concealer. Cock concealer. Yeah, we could be on to something. <laughs> we here. could be on to something. Yeah, we're the no, Kickstarter we like You might have a new job. Man. Yeah, yeah. The, the, the <laughs> Kickstarter link is right below. Uh, and before you go to that link, I just like to remind you to like, share, and subscribe to the Liquid Courage Show. Yeah, uh, I'm doing this full time now. Yeah, which is, uh, well, uh, there's no money in <laughs> There's no money at all. <laughs> no money, uh, just pleasure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, more, I, I, more pain than pleasure. Mm, more oh. pain, more yeah. pain. I don't sleep anymore. And, uh, pe and my, my, my relatives are always asking me like, Why, when are you going to get a real job? When am I going to get a real job? Mm. Boo-hoo. Mm, yeah, life, mm. is, life is tough. But speaking of jobs, uh, and not in the sex kind, not in the sex kind, uh, Nicolette, chill. Um, well, I want to ask you guys a question, which is like, um, what is a job that you would never want to do? What is a job for a living that you would never want to do? Regardless, l l let's say if I didn't want to be uh, a gardener, right? Because I hate the color green. Ugh, ugh, I hate it. Is that, that's, that feels like a personal attack. Yeah, yeah. What's up, man? What's, What's up, like, my, 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 I like you're green. You're dissing, like, My favorite grass? color is no, green. No, I'm giving you an example. <laughs> that, like, like, you, 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 you have a like green. green. Do you have a problem okay? with my music? Yeah, no, do you have I, a problem with like music? I like greener grass. I just don't like green. But it's okay because I'm colorblind. 
But I'm saying that as a gardener, I would never want to be a gardener and under no amount of money. Even if I was getting paid like uh, a lot of money, like $4 an hour, I wouldn't do it. No, shut the fuck up. I give you a million dollars a year, tell me you won't be a gardener. Nope. Really? For real? No, no. A million, a million a year. A you won't just close your eyes and like cross. Oh, oh, yeah. If I close do my eyes and cut grass, remember, grass, let me, cocks are coming let me off, remind you, uh, lie, uh. you got no job. Bro. Mm-hmm. You will freaking talk on the grass, no? I tell you. You, are, free, you, are, like. you are negative income every month. <laughs> I'm not offering you a million dollars. Mm. A million dollars a year. Uh-huh. To be a gardener. I'll give you a contract, right? Until you are so how much is a million a month? 65. million a year, how much is that a month? What is that? Uh, oh can we do a quick, dig, quick calculation? <laughs> yeah, how much is a it's million? It's almost $100,000. $100,000? $100,000? 100K plus plus? Almost 100K. No, okay, yeah. you see, right, gardeners, they work every day. When am I going to have... About? 80K. Yeah. Nah, that's a lot of money. Yeah. That's more than most people's uh, annual income. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Yeah. yeah, very high. You see, right? Gardening. Uh. It is. Okay, I'll give you 30, 30 days off a year. Wow. Wally, bro. Do you have a garden 30, 30 that days you really want me to sort out? Like, why are you convincing no, me? No, it could, be, it could be fucking multiple gardens. But you have now, to that's a lot of you work. Have, you have that's work, a, okay. that's a lot of work. The to gardens five. of Mount Batur. You know Mount Batur? You are the, gar- you are the gardens by the main gardener. <laughs> Dude, you <laughs> said that. <laughs> Garden. Bro, you know how hard is it to but get to gardens one, by the bay one, via one, public one, transport? One, one of the fucking, one of the fucking, not even the domes, dude. You're the, you're the everything except the domes, guy. So the outside. Right. And you got uh, access to like the, in Singapore, they got the, the highest end machinery and everything. Actually, this study is sort of kind of cool. <laughs> 30, 30 days, 30 but days imagine annually. my friend call me and say, hey, bro, what do you do? I sorting out gardens at the bay, like, I'm not, NDP, you know, IP one. That was a co- pretty cool job. Yeah, I would be a gardener. Yeah. So shut the fuck up. Then you've, you've already so gone you back on everything you've job. said. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Let, let, gardening was just an example. Do you have any idea of a job that you wouldn't do for any amount of money, uh, Daniel? I think for me, it's, it's something that, that smells really bad. Mm. I, I'm, I'm, I'm like sanitation. Oh, yeah. you know, like cleaning up crime scenes. Or like those, um, you know, hospital back end. Then you have to like deal with cops that kind. Or the the like undertaker stuff. Uh. Yeah, I won't do oh, it. I, I think I think the the first one you mentioned is, yeah, is the yeah, worst. Yeah. Like because the you get thing. trauma, and then you go home, got the smell one, you know. Yeah, you it's go home like and your girlfriend's on your, smell, on like a period like, or something. You smell like literally fried human, you know. I mean, okay. To be yeah. fair, right, in in this context, right, Singapore, right, how often do you have to do that shit? Worst comments just hey, like you, traffic you, evidence. You'll be surprised. Yeah, you'll you be surprised. Know, like, how many, know, like, how many, how many cases like, make, make, the, make the news? But then if you actually go yeah. to the mortality numbers, right? It's quite high. Oh, it's probably about like suicides and stuff. Like. You have to include everything because yeah, you're talking true. about it. That means that like, it's your job. Like if, if someone analyzes themselves and like jumps, right? Mm. That mess is yours to clean up. Yeah. Right. Right. Which means that like, you know, like, it could be like brain, so blood, shit. So, ma- maybe so no matter Clemens, how much you're maybe paid, Clemens you won't come, do it. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's okay. The reason why that was, that I think it's not worth it is because a million dollars a year. No, because it will affect my dating life. It will affect the way I see the world. It will, I mean, for me, for me, it will affect the way I reach home or like how I smell to other people. I assume like because this is what I heard from. Um, I had this teacher who had a friend who is doing something along the lines of this. Might not necessarily be that, but. It affected this person. Like, it's them okay, tough, you know? Something along the lines of this. What so maybe like hospital mean? when they deal with like, um, I, I ah, don't really, okay, okay. I forgot what is it already. But as long as you come out of work smelling like a corpse, I don't want to do that. La. I, I don't think I will do that. I'm okay with And that's like an everyday stuff. thing. Yeah. It's yeah. not like a, yeah. Come on. La. It's like a nightmare. What's um? What about what about what about you? What about you, uh, Nicolette? What is something that you wouldn't be able to do for no amount of money? I would never be a pest control like guy. Like 
like holding the thing and then or like person, going like or person like yeah like person <laughs> pest control person yep yep, yep. Well, I think could be damn There's, fun yeah. okay, cockroach be gone you're like fun. a hunter but right? I hate yes, yeah. I hate I like, like exactly I hate. so like no, 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 use the hate phobia. use no, no, the hate no, bro. come to the and dark like, side wear some fucking steel tobos and kick the fuckers have you seen the way they like they okay they go in and then they have to bring out the dead rats I can't it's a video, it's fucking no, trophies, it's like, eh. You fucking traumatic. take it. It's like, imagine they're in a room, right? They fumigate the place, and they all got hazmat masks and everything, right? They call like throw rats at each other, like snowball fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's like dark video, I, I hate the protection. Is fine, I hate what? the R word. No, no, no. I, like, I really cannot. Like, I have dreams that like I, I'll get eaten up by a big ass rat. Did you watch the um, <laughs> um um? I hate that show. Don't even the, say the it. Rats are <laughs> Suicide Squad. Yeah. Oh, the new yeah. one where the chick has, can control like all the rats in the world. Oh my gosh, yeah. I yeah, there was like a fuck ton of rats. What about, what about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Master Splinter. He was a cool rat. He was a pretty chill rat. No, 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 no. no. Dude, I learned so much from him there. Yeah. Stuart Little. No, Stuart Little. no, like, Ratatouille. Every, like, I hate the, what about, I hate what the about, what about, okay, that, that one that. rat that Michael Jackson sang a song about? Oh, is that a song? That's so, a song. It's a song. He made a song about a rat. It's called Ben. No way, Ben is about a rat? Yes. I love the song Ben. Come I'm on, so get lost. On ben. Get, on, get, on, get on the rat train. Bad. No, ben, not ben, on Ben. Ben, ben. 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 the two of us need to no more. You're singing about a rat right now, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> You're fucking jealous and ruined it. It's also about a rat. You look at it's the music video, it's Michael Jackson and rats all around. Why is Michael Jackson singing about rats? I love that song and shit. It's ruined now. <laughs> He's really out here ruining Chow. <laughs> Why? Okay. I, I'm it's really lost. It's about, it's about his best friend that was a rat. Huh? Michael Jackson made an incredible music, but he's a weird guy. Really, really weird guy. Weird. But also, like, his, his dad pretty much like, kept him in, his, in the Jackson 5, like in the fucking cages. Yeah, yeah, so like, yeah, his friend yeah. was a rat. Yeah, but the game's a game. Then. But yeah, no matter how much you pay me, I will never. Never. Okay, so for you now that we know it's not gardening, <laughs> what's your actual answer? I think um, any job um, that I wouldn't do for any amount of money is anything else than what I do now. Yeah. That's I'm so stubborn, bro. I'm so fucking stubborn. Wow, I could you're do so this passionate and be with your job. Broke yeah. as fuck. Yeah. You're no, such it's cringe, it's cringe. I know it is, but genuinely, <laughs> I, I, I would rather die knowing that I failed. I tried and failed, then live thinking, what if? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? But not to make it so lame, uh, I'll give you guys a fun answer. I don't want to be a swim instructor. Why? I to interact with hey, so much know, like half naked kids. You want me? My house you want this? My house got I this swim know. instructor, right? Every time he'll come Monday one, then my friends will come what, to swim. Then we always like, oh, it's that guy. It's that creepy. Hassle. I mean, we are being creepy, la, but. <laughs> oh no, but is the, the <laughs> swim instructor creepy? No, no the one, he just handsome la, we are the creepy ones on him, right, right. <laughs> we are those <laughs> oh my god now you see if I were to be a swim instructor every day I show up to work like in speedos right um, nobody asked the... you to show up in, in speedos, speedos with <laughs> kids la. Just... brother get a grip man actually I the, guy, the guy doesn't wear speedos man no la. Oh, the Speedos is the underwear one, right? Yeah. yeah. No lah. So fuck? he's wearing like the the, the full the body full suit lah. Oh, la. so oh, not like the Joseph Schooling. No, it, I don't know what Joseph Schooling wears. Joseph Schooling wears no. like the the, the 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 triangle one. No, no, yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aerodynamic. Yeah, aerodynamic, aerodynamic. I heard yeah. it pays very well though. Huh? Like what swim instructors? instructors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, not bad, not bad, decent. That's um. Uh, we, I, I have a friend. Yeah, as a swim instructor, pays really well. Can, it's a very can you good ask you a question for me? Yeah. So like, how, it's a she it, actually. It's a she. Okay, how many, how many sessions does she have a day? Mm. And like in between all of them, right? How does she get around? And does she shower after each session? <laughs> <laughs> like with like full on like soap, shampoo, and everything, right? Cause like the chlorine and everything, right? But then you're, you're spending like maybe like half an hour outside to like get into a car or bus and then go to the next place and then go back into the swimming pool, right? Like how many showers are they taking a day, dude? Well, you really would, would dry your skin out. I never asked. Like, I, 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 hey, but I actually, you know, right? It also depends on the, on the swimming I thought structure. you were going to say like, oh, actually, right? If you set the fill, which is available on my TikTok <laughs> shop, like for 99 cents a bottle. I'm not selling anything, guys. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, but it depends on the swim instructor. My swim instructor never entered the pool. Oh. So he's oh, the fine. kind that is like, standing up there, he's like, all right, 20 laps. And then he just shows you how to do the stroke like in the, like. 
on land. And then that's you're a funny, that's a funny so you, <laughs> so you literally that's, stand that's on land and then part. you're like, okay, guys, <laughs> move your hands like yeah. this. That's, that's a yeah, math teacher. Yeah, 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 the math yeah, yeah, teacher don't do math. And then you just say, go and find eggs. Go find eggs, bro. Where is eggs? Go find yourself. Figure it out. <laughs> he just it walks out. around like one end to the next and he like clocks the time and then he's like, okay, okay. No, but did and you learn how to swim? I, I learned, but that was before this swimming instructor. Oh. Uh, yeah, so why do you need a swimming instructor if you already know how to swim? No, no, why don't you, have, like why don't you believe swimming. in yourself? Like competitive swimming. Competitive oh, competitive yeah. swimming. So you're trying to swim faster than, <laughs> yes. than uh, other people. La. Yeah, some okay, people want to fish. Like, at least the demo still need to... That's why I play football. Right? My coach was still like, you don't want to play 11 aside with us. But it was still like coaches for the passing drills and all like say like, okay, this is the, this is the way you My PE teacher will just shout at us, body behind the ball constantly. <laughs> That's what he says. Yes, it's, it's true like. It's, 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 it's a good tip like. Isn't it? You ain't wrong like, you ain't wrong. <laughs> well, uh, do, you, do you guys remember your first ever job? Like the first ever thing that you did just for money? Yeah, I was in primary school. Mm. So like, ignore the labor laws here. But uh, I used to work at um, an no, unnamed- No, this wasn't in Singapore lah. An unnamed music school. Mm. Oh. So I, I I was a student there for a few months and I quit. Uh, but I, I still enjoy like hanging out over there and like playing music. So I used to like work there for like five dollars an hour and I used to like oh help like dollars. yeah, I have like clean it's up. The place. You know, but okay, no, I didn't I didn't have, I didn't have a hard job. Bad. I didn't have a hard job. So it's like five dollars. Five dollars an hour. Okay, okay, like, okay, 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 okay. I'll like dust the keyboards. Last time five dollars per hour for like a school. Yeah, last, time, okay, last time four fifty can get McDonald's full meal already. Eh. Mm. Yeah, dude. You guys remember banqueting? Oh my god. I think mm. it's oh, like yes. so many people's like my this job. That was, you that did was banqueting. a traumatic yeah, experience. Yeah, I did banqueting. Uh. Oh my goodness. There was this uncle, he pulled my hand, he was like, so are you staying now? Like, <laughs> what? What do you mean? Like staying? Yeah, uh, it was just some uncle. That was the last time I ever like did banqueting. And he just pulled my hand. Uh. I think very weird. Uh. This si pepe. What the fuck? <laughs> so, um, <laughs> Nicola, we'll come back to you, but I have a yes, story to tell. Sure. Go ahead. Why? So, um, speaking of, uh, speaking of what up. Uh, what, what the things I did for money when I was desperate, right? <laughs> Can't what, what, you, what did you do, man? So, uh, long story short, I was in school and I I broke my laptop la. So I die die needed money to get a laptop la. Really, really die die. Talking to my buddy about it, I'm not gonna say his name, <laughs> but um, but I, I asked him, I said, "Hey, bro, you got any job lobang?" No, I expecting banquet la. Mm. Expecting banquet, I expecting like. You know, maybe like event job or what. You know the shit you do when you're in poly lah. He say, hey bro, no lah. But I got this fella, right? Um, that will let you, that wants you to beat him up for money. <laughs> oh, Wait, what? I know that thing already. Is it like those um, degrading stuff? So I Sexually asked you, I was like, no, the first question wasn't that. My first question was like, how much money? <laughs> no, I'm, ser- I'm serious, I'm serious. You're like, oh, you just need to beat the fella up and you get how much. And I said, he's like, hey, bro, I'm not bad. Uh. Like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, you know, uh, about like 300 bucks. Uh. And I was like, oh, shit. When you're at that age, right, and you're thinking about like $10 an hour, $12 an hour, right? 15 minutes, you earn $300, a lot of money, yeah? Yeah, that's that's true, for sure. So I said, okay. What does what this guy want? I said, go and ask him long. So we started texting this guy. We were in class, I remember. <laughs> <laughs> texting wait, this wait, guy. How old were you? Polly. Polly. Okay. So nice. above 18, above 18 for the sake of this story. <laughs> yeah, actually, no, like, we were above 18. Uh, we were like, asking him like, hey, you know, like, uh, I got friends that are looking for money, like need money, you know, you're still doing this and all that. And he's like, ah, yeah. You know, I offer you 200, 300 if you send me a picture of you now. So we... <laughs> so we both, if, you send a, if you send a picture now, like of, of yourself so that he knows how you look like so we sent a picture and then he was like mm. so is he paying mm, to me is it, is it like, <laughs> so is it, is it a sexual thing yes mm. he wants yeah. to get beaten up and it's a common thing for him to get Degree. beaten up to the point that he goes to the hospital what bro yeah. no way yeah. <laughs> it's a degrading I'm not thing sis. I, I really am not the, the person that I was texting this guy with is in this room right now <laughs> So, so, you know, but, but just to clear something up, like, the questions got too weird, man. He was asking us, like, how tall we are, whether he can show us, like, a picture of our, like, forearms and our, like, angry no faces la, and the right shit. answer is, I'll charge more for that, though. Yeah. Yeah. No, we're not entre- entrepreneur yet, ma. We're not there <laughs> until, that, until that, man. You know, so, so. Hey, you in poly already, yeah. Yeah. Hey, see, bye. You get I, a grip. <laughs> 
I didn't know how to earn money then, okay? So I was, the questions got too weird, so we didn't end up doing it. But it was a good offer, la. Like, like if, if anyone is, is in, uh, looking for money, <laughs> uh, there are stuff like that out there, la. Not, not recommending Wait, what or endorsing it. what was the it. last draw? What was the last question yeah. that made you like, oh, okay, I'm, I'm curious. Out. No, I found this shit. He wanted to see how my throat looked like. <laughs> <laughs> Inside or outside? I didn't even ask. I didn't even ask. I was just like, hey, bro, cannot. Bro, cannot, cannot. So, so uh, uh, why I'm telling this story is because we ended up doing banquet. But the thing is, right, I used to do banquet when I was a bit younger, like I think 17. For mm. a while, I did it for like one whole year. Mm. I was fucking good at it. I become like the junior captain and fuck shit. Fucking solid. Wow, then I, I, came back, I went back to the same place. Me and my friend, was working this job, right? And all I did, right, the entire time right, was just to try and fuck with the hotel as much as possible. I won't say which hotel, but fuck I Fuck in the hotel? No, 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 not fuck in the hotel. hotel. Not fuck in the hotel. <laughs> My God, Charlene, get your head out of the fucking gutter. Not fuck in the hotel, but we, we, I, I was just trying to fuck shit up. So I go around stealing right. things like the Tabasco bottle, la, you know, like signs, pepper grinder. I just kept like trying to- Like for the thrill of it. Yeah, I didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> uh. I genuinely didn't know. I was still like wine glass, you know, uh, which ended up breaking. So I brought home a bag of glass, which was not a good <laughs> idea. You know, that's a drawstring back trend. Uh. Mm. So not a lot of protection, uh, you know. <laughs> then um, I remember right, during service, right, I managed to break the service lift. So that people, when they were hustling, going up and down, right, they couldn't use the lift. What? So, like, there were two, three events that were delayed like crazy because of me. You're a troublemaker. Yeah, 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 I did, I did. Then I remember, right, all I did, right, because there was more than enough stuff, right, I would just go into the service room and I will start talking to people, making them, like, bring them tissue, la, or whatever, right. Then I'll fuck off. Then everyone else is doing the hard work. Yeah, but I got my money then. I got money then. Yeah. Mine was $5 an hour for doing fuck all, man. Dude. Yeah, for like dusting keep. Yeah. It was, honestly, it was like, I honestly feel like I was being overpaid. Because, <laughs> because I was saving up to buy McDonald's, right? But then the guy will come and buy me McDonald's, so. Are you? That's them nice, oh, that's eh? Them nice. So it's I. Was like a money, family eh? friend or some shit? No, no, no. It's just that. It's just that I was. He saw, he saw like, okay, this guy, like, he's like really loves music and everything. Like, um, did you so show even, an, an interest in music already? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, I had signed up for lessons where I was like signing. I signed up with a friend, and then like mm. I was progressing much faster. And so I was like, this fucking waste of money. So I quit. Mm. But then I started working there, so I get an employee discount, so I could buy my first electric guitar. Ah. Uh, yeah. Okay. So like, he knew I was like saving up for the guitar. So uh, he would like buy me McDonald's, and then like uh, just like sit down, chill out there, and eat. Do a bit of work every Nothing now and sexual then. Nothing like. sexual happened. Nothing sexual. Okay, right. This is how things you ask. Come on. Yeah, fair, fair, fair. Yeah, fair yeah. Fair on this show, on this show, this is the type of things you really do ask. No, but yeah. yeah. So eventually, I saved up um, for the guitar, and then like he gave me the employee discount on top mm. of that. So mm. Mm. you can hear the full story about Daniel's journey on August Man, the latest issue. But back to you. What is your first job, uh, Nicolette? <laughs> I was so desperate to get a job when I turned like when I finished um, my IV and back then yeah but then basically like I was so desperate to like get a job so I just took up like anything that I saw on those like telegram chats oh and so I just telegram chat yeah and then it said like there was somebody that needed a receptionist and I was like okay I'm just gonna go so that what was what age my... was IB finished IB finished is what age I, I ended at 18 18 ah yeah. I graduated when I was 18 okay yeah but basically I, I went down and it was like a, a, the receptionist it was an auntie and she was like what are you doing here like why like why are you doing this as your <laughs> Job. And I was just like, oh, I don't know. Like, I, I just want to take anything that was paying me at that time. Mm -hmm. And that was my first job. And then subsequently after that, I'll just take up any jobs that I saw on like, the Telegram mm. uh, job chat. So I was like working at Isetan, folding clothes. Then the Amas there would be like, oh, you know, why, why are you doing this? Like, we're doing this to kill time. Like for the Amas, like, they're just doing that to kill time. They're so just then vibing. They, like, they're just vibing. They're really like, vibing. vibing. And then they were like, yeah, but what are you doing here? And then, but I was so desperate for money. <laughs> I was just like any job. And then when like cafe, like cafe job, I would go down and I would really like dress up like thinking it's a proper, like real, like very real interview, you know. So you know like So you wear the, like tie all la. Like the, like the, <laughs> the blazer with the skirt for a cafe. Hi, hey, but this is a McDonald's. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome no one, to McDonald's. Our customers don't even wear suits, bro. <laughs> and I took it like so, like so freaking so seriously. Cute. Yeah. yeah. But then after that, like I, ch I also stumbled upon this like job that like, I was asking this guy whether like he has any like lobang la. Then he said, hey, you know like this one can Hey, you ask you whether you got lobang right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, is that okay? Is that okay? Can we keep that in? Oh, sorry. Yeah, Nicola, you can, can pick it to you. <laughs> <laughs> and then he was telling me like, oh, you know, it's like, you just, you just have to usher people into this event and you get like $10 per hour. And at the time, $10, I was like, oh, 
Oh my gosh, oh, yeah, today yeah, yeah, I yeah, need yeah. that job. So then I, I actually sent in my resume. And then that guy, so it was a fintech company, like a startup. And then that guy was like, oh, I see like, you know. Wait, sorry, wait, your job's the usher, right? Honestly, do you need to send in your resume? You need to send in a video. I know, I know, I know. Tell me, tell me, tell me. But, but sending in my resume, right, actually got that guy um, going like, okay, um, can we actually like have you on board as like a marketing person. Oh. Ah, because he was like, hey, you nice. can you fall for it? Okay, yes. Wow. You get, get a full and then it was, like, also, uh. it was like, well, it was really like a fake it till you make it moment for me. Because I was like, oh, yeah, 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 I can, I can, I can. And then um, he was like, do you know anything about like, um, like finance? I was like, no, no, I don't know, but I can learn, I can learn. So I was just like, everything, I was, everything that he said, I was like, okay, okay, I'll learn about the stock market. I'll learn about like this and that. And then, yeah, it was actually a pretty like, good, like good job, like, I guess. So, so like, when the lubang come out? What? When the lubang come out? What do you that's mean? the lubang lah. Oh, oh, that's oh, that's oh. The usher, oh, the usher thing, the <laughs> usher thing turned into like a actual mm, like. Mm. Oh, wait, so the marketing one, how much? No, it was like still like a part time basis. <gasps> oh. Yeah, but it was it was like it was good for my resume. It's good lah. Yes, and then I was going through a shit period at that time, right? And my boss was relationships, just like, is it? Yeah, relationships. Mm, mm, but my boss, I, will, like, I will wake up and like, okay, I won't even wake up because I've never, I didn't even go to sleep. I'll show up to office like with my eyes like swollen, I and know. then he's just like, uh, do you want to go and grab like coffee at Yakun? And then he like actually like talked me through like my entire breakup process. So that was a pretty like good. So job, how long like, did you and your boss like, end up dating? What? How long did you and your boss end up dating? I was gonna say. Job and free therapy lah. Well, what the fuck, Clement? Yeah, it was yeah. actually free therapy, okay? Oh. Wait, 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 wait. But was he ever uh. interested in you? No. <laughs> also, can I just ask, why is uh. Charlene's hair blowing? Why you got like effect one? You got like some fucking Laurier like commercial going on. Where's what the thing? wind coming from? Hey, the aircon last, yeah. Oh, okay, you don't know okay. this I'm is so called- confused. This is called the pretty girl glow. No, I'm seriously, yes, I'm like, am I seeing like- shit right now? Like, <laughs> what, what? Like what? What's this bitch on, dude? Like why is she flying? <laughs> okay, because Daniel's not moving. She's not moving. But somehow her hair is just like flowing as she's talking about like jobs and shit like that. I'm like, oh, yes. what, what's happening? What's happening? No, okay. So so you got a job uh, initially as a part time. Ended up doing a marketing job. Um, I can't believe I have to ask this question now, but I have to. I have to ask this question. Um, what do you guys think about doing OnlyFans when you just need money? Let's go to Daniel first. The fucking I'm, silence. I'm a big, I'm, a, I'm very vocal. I'm, I'm a so big loud. fan of this. So mm. I, I, I want to start my my own OnlyFans. Mm, we are working on it strategy yeah. wise. I've, wor- I've already done the photo shoots. Mm, photo oh. shoots are done. Yeah. How you do the photo okay, shoots? Okay, what what do you, what do you think stops people from doing OnlyFans? Because I feel like right, if I could, you know, if I could, I would. We we've had on one of the the top only fans. Yes, yes. Uh, Sakura in a in a previous uh, last season last season. I think it's quite okay like It's not something I would do, but I think it's okay one. Like you want to do, you yeah. want to do like. It's okay, just so that so you say that it's something. Uh, what uh, about what about what about non nudes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, Sakura yeah. doesn't do nudes. Yeah. She does it does, nudes. It doesn't, it, doesn't, it doesn't have to be. Nudes. Yes, yeah, it's it doesn't, not nudes. Doesn't have to be nudes. Mm. Ah, mm, I would say it's how you want to market yourself, law. Yeah, like next time. I don't know, I wanted to do like the OnlyFans for Bubbles, you know, not in that way. I know like the animal society will come for me, but <laughs> I just wanted something fun, okay? I just wanted to take picture of my dog and upload. That's about it. But I honestly feel like if girls want to hustle and if they want to show that they can market this very well, right? Go for it. Yeah. OnlyFans is not like, hey, you just show a body, you have to like... What was that called? There's actually a lot of work eh, that goes behind OnlyFans. Yeah, and also you have to like tease the viewers, you know, you have to say like in a certain la. way, uh. then they will sub, then they will pay, then they will mm. buy. So it's not something that like, oh, you don't have like prince, that's why. Right. No, ha, sister, it's not mm. like that one. Yeah. So you, 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 you I think just, it's quite slay. Le. You just said that this is something that you would never do. No. Right? But that's just for you. Yeah, nah. because um, parents got judgment. Wa. How will my parents see me? I'm If I cannot I take that, right? My father come home laugh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I met Daniel's dad at a, at a drink with him. Uh, we met him at a gig and uh, he's damn chill. I feel like he would enjoy it. He's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> so you guys guy. Yeah, so I think he'll just laugh. Yeah, he'll just laugh. Confirm. No, but I think, okay, <laughs> one thing to acknowledge is that like, it how a guy perceives his own body is different from a girl's perception of her own body. Mm. Right, like that's just the truth, right? Whether you disagree with me or not, that's fine. But I personally think that a guy, yo, 
if my cock's out just by accident, you know, I'm 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 fine. I'm fine. No, you you are different. So you <laughs> Yeah. He is too comfortable being naked in front of anybody. Like on the shuttle bus. Oh. Yeah. Cock. Yeah, like his cock is out it's a free much bus more ride. than it's it has a free to be. bus ride. What the fuck do you expect from the audience there? Huh? What? It's a shuttle what? bus, it's a free bus ride. And what then? is your expectations of being in that environment? It's not, it's, it's, it's not just him, it's his friends also. They, right. they encourage each other to, to take their cocks out. Birds of the same feathers fall together. Like, he was me. <laughs> birds! <laughs> uh, my guy, hey, come on. Yeah, this cool. one, you're, you're, you're encouraging him as a bestie. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see this going on. Birds, yeah. <laughs> Funny fella, you joker. No, I think... <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, but, but, but back to it, right? Like, it really is different. Like, I would never understand what it's like to be a girl, right? And, and that perception that comes with it. I could walk, I could take, my, like, my dick out and just walk one round, you know, just for cardio. Just for cardio. Worst comes, I can't storm, or worst comes, I can't storm, make someone uh, earn the $50 or so that's about you. Right? But I think for a girl, it's a bit different. Like, you know, ever since I started this show, Ever since I started this show, right, I realized how tiring it is to be a female on the internet, especially TikTok. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, Why? I don't. Like, I could say the exact same thing as, for example, Charlene or, or Nicolette, right? And I would get zero views, zero comments. But if they say something, something right, then there'll be a shit ton of people saying like, "Oh, girls nowadays," or like, "Wow, this girl op- hey. just don't need to open mouth, open lip can really like <gasps> shit like that." That's so seen. rude. Oh my I, god. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I filter a lot of this shit out on, on fucking out on our own fucking platform, please guys. But it, it happens, and I could say the exact same shit, and I don't get the same response. It, I would never know the experience of what it's like to be a chick in, especially in the social media space. But it's the people that will say this kind of thing, so like, who raised you, huh? Hmm? I feel yeah, like, like, you are one who I fight back more than normal. Well, I make it funny. La. Yeah, I make it, she make it funny, <laughs> but she will roast me also. La. I enjoy it, I enjoy it. Yeah, uh, and, I don't encourage anyone commenting on your shit, la, mm, but, but I'm saying it happens, it just fucking but happens. I encourage you to it's fuck like, that What possessed you to say such stuff? Mm. Oh my god, who hurt you, my darling? Mm. <laughs> but it's mm. always the same kind of people that start yeah, So you, you have a lot of, do you have experiences like that as well? Or? Yeah, for sure, la, but I mean, I, I just rationalize in my head that these people like don't know me, they don't even know my story, and they're just mo- most probably like, sitting in their room, Jacking their tiny off. ass room, yeah, and like, I don't know, like. You know her, but you don't know her story. Mm, (laughs) mm, mm. I think think guys get less like just general hate comments. Yeah, because no one gives a shit besides you. Besides you, no, (laughs) I got, I got, I get a few every now and then. Yeah, yeah, me too. Wow, okay, there was, there was one, there was one last year that was quite bad. (laughs) Before that, the worst was just like one, one day just saying fuck that. That's it. (laughs) <laughs> yeah, so that was, I thought I also just thought it was quite funny. Yeah. Right? But there was one there was one that was last year that wasn't even one of my videos. Um I was doing a collab with this other channel and so we, we had a race of um who can get to from from our office in Singapore to KL Central first by plane or by car. So we did this race. <laughs> and then there was this it was, a, it was a good video, like it went pretty viral on Facebook, people were enjoying the content. Mm-hmm. I'm not even a part of that channel, like. I was just like a guest invited mm-hmm. along just to make mm-hmm. it more fun. And one person commented, uh, Daniel said, fast, fuck, go die a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bro, <laughs> it's like, it is, you're not wrong, la, but, <laughs> but also fuck you. That's fucking unnecessary as fuck, right? What like, if you was, you made it nah, so funny, nah, nah, I can say this, I can say this, right? I can say this, right? But like, if it was a video of you doing a mukbang where you're eating butter, <laughs> Then they comment this kind of thing, fine, fine. Well, what am I doing, bro? I'm the fucking passenger. Oh, yeah, bro, you're just sitting in the car, chilling, thinking of what playlist to play. Bro, you I'm, know? Pure, I'm purely there for vibes. Oh, ah, right. just for vibes. Uh, well, any final thoughts about um, what people do for a living and. <laughs> well, I don't know. What? <laughs> that was the original topic, lah. Uh, Nicolette, all you, all you. I'm sorry, what was your huh? <laughs> what, 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 uh, final thoughts about what to do for a living and what you wouldn't do for a living and why you think it's not okay for chicks to do OnlyFans go I think it's perfectly fine if the chick wants to do an OnlyFans oh, you told me oh, <laughs> you told me on MSN throw her under the bus he really likes to put words in my mouth but I think it's no. perfectly fine I think it's major respect if like that's how you want to hustle do your mm. thing like that's very slay and queen energy and if it's like if it's something that you want to do like just go ahead and do it lah like don't think so much about like what other people yep. like don't say. think so much about what your don't parents think, just will do. think your boyfriend parents will think I'm gonna get cancelled from this fucking hell okay yeah Charlene go ahead 
slay. <laughs> Yay! But it's just, I mean, it's fine lah. You want to do, then you do law. I mean, like Clement, he wants to chase his dreams. He super loved this Man, job. My small, little cute dreams. I want to go chase. <laughs> <laughs> great chase I will never work little. another job Very like fitting. this. Yeah, Very yeah. fitting. I do I do I do <laughs> No, but that said, ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for tuning in to the Liquid Curry Show, the World's Own Podcast <laughs> Film. In the Nitro Bar, a.k.a. Al Capone's, one of 14 outlets. Uh, uh, do, do join us on Marbok Mondays. Yeah, we're going to have a good time on Marbok Mondays. Um, follow us on TikTok and Instagram at Liquid Curry Show for more from us behind the scenes and just more of these beautiful people over here. Follow us and read us five stars on Spotify if you really feel like I ugly. La. I mean, feeling ugly recently. So, like, just, just, just do the Spotify instead. Spotify is fine. Spotify is fine. Follow us. Read us five stars. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Before we end up the show, Daniel said is going to tell you how to live your life in three, two, one. So guys, okay. this is where we get real introspective. I want you to search deep within yourself. Close your eyes for a second. Don't look at me. Look inwards. And all you have to ask yourself is, am I a chibai? Fuck! <laughs> and if the answer is no, all good. If you're a chibai, go fuck yourself, dude. You're a chibai, if you're a chibai, chibai nobody, go nobody wants to be your yourself. friend, la, okay? Reevaluate life, get a real job, stop chasing your dreams, baby. <laughs> yeah, stop chasing your dreams. Stop chasing your dreams, a Chase 9 to 5 is dreams. perfectly fine. You have to fine. pay the bills, don't mm, forget. Mm, remember, if, remember. If anybody has lobang for Gardner for $1 million a year, please let Clemmer know. He is interested. What a mine, actually. What a mine, energy. Thank you so much, Daniel, uh, for your words of advice. That says, ladies and gentlemen, uh, thank you guys thank you guys for watching and tuning in. We will see you guys in the next one. Cheers. Cut cameras, please. <laughs>